Generic greetings and welcome to Luna's Fishing Garden. Today's beverage is a nice relaxing cup of chamomile tea. Actually, no, technically it is a chamomile and honey infusion. So, well, there you are to be specific. Either way, welcome to Luna's Fishing Garden. It is built as a short, relaxing building and fishing game. And that's interesting because I don't think I've ever seen the term short used in a promotional piece, but there you are. It's a game I picked up when it came on Steam and because I've played one of the developers of the games, uh, Merchant of the Skies, and it looked fairly cutesy and fun, and it is those things, but I haven't yet completed it, so this is not really a first impressions, I'm just going to play a little bit of it and, uh, you know, bring you along for the ride, because it is something I'm enjoying at the moment, and I thought you may want to check it out. So the idea is that we have a couple of quests at this stage, so Collector of, uh, of Knowledge, Visit the Lighthouse, and Jellybean's Fishing Tour number two to catch breadfish, and we have different characters, so we have these three monkeys here, by the way, I'm just going to pick up some of this stuff because, well, we can sell it. We have, um... Well, that, that, that seems to be a cat in a dressing gown, which is... Well, if you thought that was weird, let me just go over to the right and we'll see uh, Jellybean, who is a sea lion, a walrus, a uh, seal? I'm not really too sure, but um, either way, they have a sort of plastic mac and uh, <laughs> jacket on. Interesting. Anyway, it says uh, visit the lighthouse, and I'm pretty confident the lighthouse is here, but how much do we need to get access to that? We need to... Hmm... We need 250, which is on the top left. 250 generic units of currency, which we just don't have. So I'm going to go for fishing. There's two modes for fishing. There's the simple mode for fishing and the normal mode. I'm currently on normal mode. Simple, you just have to sort of time bringing the fish up and then don't reel in as the fish is sort of fighting. For this other one, you get this bar, and as the fish goes up, you press space to make sure you keep this uh, line in there and once it goes green you get a fish we've just caught a minnow so she seems to be quite happy there and oh here we go so we have to time this right so we keep this in the green and there we go we've now found a guppy so we're just going to keep doing this because this will give us some money it seems that i don't know whether the fish themselves have different um like fighting techniques and trying to get away so whether or not we can determine the fish from this is going to be a mackerel no it's a catfish um, but there you are. So I'm just trying to get this as best as I possibly can, and I think we're about right. Yeah, there's a guppy as well. While I'm... Actually, let's not do that. I need to go and get this bamboo, and also get these pearls as well. But I think I'm fairly close to... Oh yeah, I was going to say fairly close to a full inventory. So I'm just going to jump out, and then go over to here, and then we'll talk them and say sell items, and then we gain... Oh, a nice amount of money. We have 241, so that's okay. We can also press B to go to build, and we can place more stuff. So you've got, like, crab traps, watermelons, etc. Uh, let's open our quest log here. And we have, for Luna, we've done tasks there. Um, for Jelly Bean, we need to find breadfish. Never heard of them, but that won't stop me. And then Nigel the uh, Owl, by the look of it. Um... Uh, yes, if I can visit the lighthouse and clear the fog, I can travel to new islands. Right, okay. So, and then, yeah, I guess we're just going to have to do one of those. I'll let you pick this up first, and I think probably pick these up, and then we'll go visit the lighthouse, because then that will expand the area that we can go to. So just go here, and then sell. It, you can pretty much you can pretty much play the game with just WSD and space. Uh, you obviously have the mouse, but not... Uh, overly necessary for most parts but let's just go over to the lighthouse it's got 331 and uh, we will extend that so the lighthouse activates and ah there we go it is extended to the right hand side not to the left though i'm guessing there's another way to do that perhaps so let's just go ahead and see what other character we can meet we also get these like scraps in the water and you have to clean these up the whole point is you want to um pick it up and ah is that ah that's one of those flightless pirates isn't it um I can't remember the name. Uh, is it like a kakapo? Kakapo? I know one of the pirates is called Sirocco because I saw a, a thing uh, with Stephen Fry, I think, and Mark Cowardine. Anyway, uh, what marvelous specimens we have here. Large cranium, uh, opposable thumbs, bipedal, yes. Unless you're a particularly hairless and crafty possum, I'm gazing upon a genuine human shriek. Uh, my name is Nigel, wildlife specialist and researcher. I had a field journey, but sadly the storm claimed. Oh, field journal, but sadly the storm claimed it. Perhaps you can help me accomplish, uh, complete a new one. Bring any seven unique items you encounter on this uh, archipelago and return. I'll upgrade your backpack's capacity. Oh, okay. So we need to just bring back stuff. Uh, all right, so we just need to find things. Right, let's do that. So we can fish. Let's see what these fish are like. The uh, fish, I think, can be a bit more problematic to catch based on 
where they are and you can see I'm just I'm just messing that up somewhat I'm just trying to keep that in that right area and we've got ah next lot oh this is gonna be difficult I can already tell now nah, failure yeah so if you don't if it goes right to the bottom it is a failure state and you just lose the fish and whoop hang on hang on how on and flounder okay <laughs> she's overjoyed when she catches a fish as well oh this is really problematic this fish but we're about there another flounder uh, I'll go and hand this into Nigel in a moment and come on I think I'm gonna lose the fish no no it's a bit better a bit better I say the easy mode is very easy you simply wait for the like say start reeling the fish in and then once you get to a certain point oh there we go nice yeah once you get to a certain point you um you just have to let go and stuff but i prefer this one it's a little bit more engaging so i'm just going here and i'm just clearing this up because it says scrap and we can sell this to get money so that's all right and all right inventory is full so we will have to go back i'll actually go back to to nige first see what he see what he's all about so there we go and uh no don't think we have anything there but we can go for fauna and do we not have do we not have any of these oh do we just need to catch them all uh, oh add items to collection then we can check that yes there we go that's what we want so flounder born it born symmetrical but after a couple of days flattens out and its eyes shift to one side axotl Adorable little amphibian that can regrow lost body parts, even when parts of it, even parts of its brain. That's a quite useful thing. Okay, so we've done that. Let's go back. We're going to sell up. Um, actually, I won't sell up just yet because I want to collect the pearls. Oh, the monkey's gone. Oh, shame. The three monkeys. Pearl, pearl. Let's see if I can collect these. No, inventory full because we've collected loads of scrap, you see. And sell items and also so you've met Nigel that's right well I sincerely hope you're not just letting him weird around in soil can you clear out the debris around the island hope hopefully you will show some decency around him he's a academic after all yeah so we have a quest um let's do that then let's just pick up some of this as well because I think Nigel will probably want some bamboo and we'll get some fish for for Nige you can upgrade your rod I think as well but you have to well, costs money. I'm going to see how much the next level of upgrade is. We'll go and talk to the... Yeah, we'll go and talk to the guy on the next island. Yeah, the connector... Of, oh, failed that one. Connector of knowledge is... You need two of seven. Oh, I've got... I should I say I've got two of seven. And we now have greener islands as well. Oh. Just getting the time and right is... we need and close no yes yes come on come on fish 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 yes mackerel good uh, okay let's go and talk to him uh, 350 for a rod this is fishing upgrades okay well I've not actually caught anything from this so I'm gonna try here you can see we've not caught anything here so I'll give it a go but the last time I was here it the fish was really yeah it was this um, I don't really know what I can do about that. That is a fish that is very much not in the market to be caught. Um, although we're getting close. Goldfish. Okay. Let's just keep going then. And you can see it's really... Like, difficult to catch. Uh, there's a breadfish. Oh, he wants breadfish. Right, we need two bread... We need one more breadfish. Technically, I want three breadfish because then hand it into Nigel. There is a story that goes with it and why we're here, but I'm not going to spoil too much of that. Um, to be honest, though, if I'm being honest, I think it is just about the moment where I'm just chilling out and doing some fishing and some building and, and stuff. Um, it doesn't really have a purpose other than itself, which is fine, I guess. Can't really speak for the length, but I'm going to get short since the store page does say short. So, there you are. Oh, good grief. This is, this is the goldfish, is it? Yeah, <laughs> just so difficult to catch. But this one's not too bad. I'm just mashing space by there just to keep that in. And a sea bream. A bream. Uh, 
Oh, hang on, here we go. Just get it bouncing. No, no, fail, fail, fail. Um. Should be alright, this one. I mean, if I just stay near the top, that's where it's gonna get there eventually, isn't it? So instead of trying to miss it all the way through, if I do this, it should hopefully be better. It's just bouncing at the bottom, then another goldfish. Alright, you know what? I'm gonna go to Nige, and I'm gonna hand in the the samples here. <laughs> is it is a Kappa pill? I can't remember what it is. Anyway, um, there we go. Splendid! I'll begin recording our new findings at once. Please, take this. Yes, we can now place more items into our inventory. It's actually a bit concerned. Ever since the storm, Gaia, our great guardian spirit, has been all but silent. Uh, may it behove you to locate Sam, leading the scholar in the Gaia-related items. Okay, and what else? Citizen scientist. The field journey is off to a great start, but you'd very much like to see more. Could you gather five new specimens? Once I get my claws on more research subjects, see about enhancing the backpack of yours further. Okay, good. Um, so there we go. There's some of the specimens that we've got. That's pretty good. Happy with that. Right, so now that that's emptied, I'm going to go here and just sort of clear out this island. Um, also, that looks to be something we can pick up, but I don't think we can. Uh, this one we can. And that's just, uh, just classed as scrap. There we go. So we can't go any further to the right. I'm assuming that we can enhance the island. Sorry, enhance the um, lighthouse later on. That seems to be fairly clean, right? Yeah, there we go. It does say visit the lighthouse. Yeah, so we definitely need to do that. Uh, I'm just going to do a bit more fishing here and see what this is like. I want to... Upgrade my fishing rod as well. Uh, <laughs> seems to have not much fighting at this fish. Oh, there we go. An eel! We got an eel. One more bit of fishing. Just hanging around there, is it? Fine. Uh, we should get it now. Yeah. Right, I'll hand that in. Very cutesy. Very relaxing. And then you go for the fishing. It's really difficult at times. There's <laughs> some uh, gulls at the back there. Just going to go over to the far left. I still need breadfish, but it's not too bad. Let's just collect these. Bamboo. Bamboo. Um, oh, the pearls. I can probably hand the pearls in as well to, to Nige. Let's just see. You made a quick work of that. This exceeds my expectations. Well, the day is still young. I'd only ever heard of stories of humans before you came along. You're different than I thought you'd be. Oh, there's money. I like money. Uh, I'm gonna... I'm gonna sell up. There we go. 612. What can we build for 612? We've got crab trap, watermelons, a capybara house. Okay. I mean, we... We could, we could build that. What else have we got? Trees, avocado trees, banana trees. Do you want a banana tree? I'm trying to give them up, to be honest. Um, I think what I'll do is just grab these. Grab the pearls. So, uh, we are basically free to do what we want in terms of crafting and building and such. And I, I think... Let's go for rods there. Yeah, let's get a rod uh, upgrade. Yeah, I think it's one of those things that you can... Probably just build you out of it or fish you out of it in terms because you know to get that money. Oh, good grief! That just does that. Just gonna keep it up the top, you know, because it's still fishing is still happening, and also a lot easier now. We've got this rod. There's a goldfish. Let's see if we can get these breadfish. We need two breadfish. Oh, darn it! Mix that one up. There we are. That's good. Yeah, you can tell we've got that rod upgrade, and there's another sea bream. This one's going to go ballistic, is it? Not, not too bad. Breadfish. Right, one more breadfish. Come on. Nige, uh, not Nige. Uh, I think he needs fed. Feeding. Jelly bean. See what this is. Feels like goldfish. Sea bream. Yeah, not much fighting in the bream. <laughs> oh, here we go. So just keep near the top. 
No. It should be all right. Breadfish. There we go. Right. Let's get him fed. <laughs> we know what we get off it. Probably money. Give items. Okay, here. Yeah, yeah. You reeled in a couple of them already, boys. Nicely done, lass. While we're on the topics, or strange fish, did I ever tell you about the time I wrestled with the biggest koi I ever saw? Oh, I wonder if it's the same koi that was from uh, Merchants of the Skies. I wonder if we see that carrot thing as well. Must have been 20, no, 50 feet long with shiny golden scales. And hey, well, yeah, it's... So, yeah, it's the one that got away. Uh, we have the Jelly Beans Fishing Tour number three, so we'll just skip all the text. Uh, we need to catch go oh, goldfish. Oh, well, uh, there you go. There's a <laughs> that was a simple one, wasn't it? B bouncing barnacles. Are those goldfish I see shimmering? Yeah, you're a heck of an, of an angler, angler there, kiddo. Ain't the cutest little goldfish this side of 77 seas. Welcome to your new home. Moby Rick and Moby Mick. <laughs> and we'll pick up the another one. Right, lass, my belly's rumbling for something fierce again. Gonna make some hefty meal out here next haul. And move for some favourites. Some eel. Ah, right, so I know where the eel is. Um, it's a bit further away. Tell you what, let's just pick these up. And I'm gonna go over to the right. And we'll see if we can catch some eels and also hand in some samples. Um, I'm also tempted to build some more. Um, let's get the resource from the water. Watermelon. I'm gonna place a watermelon there. Why not? It'll get you know we'll get money off it as we come back. I don't know what the growing periods for it is. It is 45 seconds by the look of it. All right. Lighthouse. It says visit the lighthouse. Let's see what it's gonna be. 50, uh, 500. Would you reckon? 750. I have no one near that amount of money. Let's just see. Let's see if we can hand in some samples. No, nothing. Shame. Right, eels it is. Let's see if we can get eels. We're already cleaned up on the other island, so we don't need to do much there. That's good fishing. Fairly easy at one. Oh, black bass. But a sea bass. Actually, is it a sea bass or a black bass? It said black. It's from the sea. I mean, it could be anywhere, to be fair. We've got these weird animals in all sorts. We don't know what place we're at. Well, I'm trying to keep in touch with this. Seems to be working. There you go. Just getting the rhythm there, right? Huh. It's one of those. Look at the gold just landed right next to us, hoping for a free meal. We'll pray on some tourists elsewhere for a chip or something. Uh, I'll tell you what, I'll hand these in. Because that should be two now. There we go. Magnificent. Scree. <laughs> not going <laughs> to not gonna say what I think they want us to say. Uh, let's see here. Yes, very good. These will do nicely now. If you just hand them to the backpack of yours. There we go. Much better backpack. Excellent. And we'll go for the next scientist. Which is going to be, yeah, the next expansion. So we're up to 18. So... Yeah, there's all those. Right, good. Um, let's go for more eel. We need more eel. More eel, more better. For jelly bean. Be interesting to see what other characters are in the game as well. I assume, well, I know there's more because it's I've seen some pictures of it, I think. But I think this is pretty much what you do in the game. Talking to different characters, being in the world, fish, craft. It's weird to, it's very difficult to pigeonhole the game. Hmm, that's not a fighter. <laughs> Whatever it is, it's going to be the, oh, one of those. Anything but eels. Oh, did we get eels from here, actually? Or was it the other one? Flounder. Uh, no, eels are from here, I think. Second one to the left. Flounder. Loads of fish. We're exhausting the supply single-handedly. <laughs> um, I think he's got all samples of these. It would be nice if there was a way to select... Can you select what type of fish? I don't think you can. You can't just go for eel. No. 
Like different types of lures and bait. Oh, I failed on that one massively. Oh, this one like really it fails quickly. This one, if you don't get it right. Eel, one eel, one more left. Stay in touch with it. There we go. It's the bounce back down that I get wrong. There we go, that. Black bass. Ah, inventory full. Right, I think you can hand in just one of them. I'm pretty confident you can, so I'll do that. I don't know what... Oh, there's one fish there that we've not found. So let's go ahead and... Give items. It says one. Yeah, we've done one of them so far. Oh, there's that lettuce done. Let's sell all that. That's in good money. Oh, very good money. Tell you what we're going to do with that. We are going to... Buy some guides. Nice. Right, back over. I'm going to catch here. I want to see what the last fish is here. And I'll see if I can hand it in to... Nige. There's another breadfish. <laughs> we'll have to read what breadfish is. Another goldfish. Oh, it's much easier. So the upgrades allow us to fish in a better... In, in more... Well, in better waters, I guess. And also... With uh, different different fish. Let's keep in touch with that one. And sea bream again. Still one that eludes us. <laughs> oh wow. That was a simple one. Right. Seems a bit weird this one. Breadfish again. There's still one that's a question mark, so either it's a fish that's literally a question mark. This feels like a breadfish. <laughs> yeah, it's either it either is a question mark, yeah. Or <laughs> Oh, it's one we haven't identified. Uh I'm gonna go with Sea Bream. Yeah, so you can identify the fish by the look of it from the way they go. Oh, this is the one that I've really struggled with. Looks like we're getting it though this time. Yes, a neon tetra. Brilliant. And the goldfish. Right, let's hand in that uh, unique item. And... I want to hand it in because I just don't want to sell it. Uh, let's go for fauna and breadfish. Said it would have paired well with uh, peanut butter fish, which is sadly <laughs> fish to extinction. Right. Okay. Curious. Um, there's nothing to clean up on there. I'm going to collect some supplies. I'll see what else we can build. We need an another eel. Watermelon, yeah. And then these here as well. Obviously, you can't, when you place stuff, like, say, crab trap, you can only place it in an area where you haven't already placed something. Uh huh. Sell items. How are we gonna, what are we going to get from that? Well, fair bit. Can't we buy our house then, shall we? There we go. Oh! <laughs> Hello! <laughs> right? Ah, oh, and they follow me. Oh! Do they automatically. Ah, they're automatically collecting stuff for us. Or are they just nicking it? Um. <laughs> <laughs> no, they're definitely collecting pearls. So how? And what can I do to? Oh, and they automatically sell it. Oh, brilliant. Okay, that was well, well worth it. Right, we're going for the. Why am I excited about getting a capybara thing? The fact that there's two capybaras just paddling along <laughs> just makes me smile. Right, eels. Come on, we're about the eel. Right. And... Yeah. Simple one, that one. Just keeping in touch with this. And... Black bass. 
I guess the specimens that he wants, I won't have many because, well, basically, I need to plant stuff. So you want to know, like, what a banana is and things. I don't know if you have to do a full complete on it. I feel like I want to. Flounder. Yeah, not much fighting the flounder. Oh. Right. Here we go. This is the fight. Good, though. Oh, no! Out of sync. Got out of sync. It's doing so well. Got it. Yeah. Still no eel though. The eel eludes us. And I don't know why. Getting close though. Every single one of these. We do. Could find that eel. It's not this one though. No, black bass. Ah, sip of beverage. Um, keep fishing. We need the eel. Simple as that. We need the eel. Another flounder. I don't know if these are randomly generated. Like what's in these pools. I assume not. Doesn't feel that way. And another one of those. We're going to be very close to a full inventory. Is this the eel? Yeah. Yeah, so you can recognise it. At least I did. Right, we'll hand that back in. And that's another Jelly Beans Fishing Tour at number four this time. So, give items. Great. You brought Jelly Beans a meal and... Ah, yeah. <laughs> Made this day uh, for going from good to great, little landlubber. Now, if you don't mind, this mouth's got a date with some sushi. Uh, we'll just pick up the Fishing Tour next. And what do they want this time? Black bass. Uh, yeah, that, that, that's that's handed in. Um, <laughs> should start calling your bestie. Ah, you're not going to do that. Yeah, okay. Um, is that it? Is there no more quests for him? Oh, that's a shame. Um, let's go for the additional line then. And... And can I just... Get paid? Or are they just going to constantly nick everything that I have? I want to get a lettuce. I want to get the sea lettuce um, to. No, no, they put money in. Sea lettuce to hand in because I haven't handed in a sea lettuce yet. I was going to put another sea lettuce in as well, but we'll see. <laughs> we'll see. Do you remember me? So swim with the clouds, visit the lighthouse, and then I need seven fifty for the lighthouse. Then gather unique items thirteen of eighteen. I know if I move off, there we go. I know if I move off, it'll all go wrong. I uh, don't want to sell items yet. I want to hand that in. Let's see what I can build. Um, another watermelon. There we go, because they, they stack up quite nicely. And, you know, money and all that. So what if we do get that money that they're messing around with? Or they're collecting. Well, they just nick it. <laughs> We've just moved in some people we don't want. There we go. We're on 14 of 18. Now I can sell up. Now I can sell up. But fishing should be very easy now, considering we've got... Oh yeah, just... Let's just see, yeah, plus 15 when we've got the... Yeah, should be very easy now that we've got the... Almost the max rod. And... I'm going to go for a crab trap. Put one there, why not? And we've got lotus... Put one there. Uh, I think that's everything but the cattails. Which I will put over here. So small cattail. And then cattail. There we go. It'll take a little bit of time for those to grow. But I'm just going to collect them for... For Nige. I wonder how far those capybaras go. Oh, there's Lotus. Just get it before those. Yeah, I wonder how far the they travel. Oh, can confirm quite a bit. 
So I'm going to collect them myself because I don't want those to get it. At least it's nice that they travel slower than you. Which means they're not going to rush before you and get it. There's the pearls being collected. I'm just waiting for this crab trap. And there's a lotus. They're going to probably pick that up. Oh, there we go. Gather the crab. Right. So, hand these in. So that should be one, two, three, four specimens. Possibly. I think so. I think that'll get us to the next one. No, just the two. Okay, that's a shame. Um, yeah, just the two. We need 750 for that lighthouse. That's fully fished, yeah. We've done those. I think we've done those samples. I think we have. Just go back to here and hand that in. Sell items. Thir How much was that? 35 for the crab. So the only thing I haven't got is... Actually, I've got everything from that. I just don't have these trees. Um, the trees, I'm not going to place on this island because he's there. But on this one instead. So... We can do a coconut tree, but we've got a banana tree and avocado. So we'll place a banana tree and an avocado tree as well. Oh, that's a, that's okay. That's a big tree, um, as one might imagine. Oh, we can't place it there. That's a shame. Do I get money back if I scrap it? Possibly, but I don't want to risk it. So instead, I'll put that banana tree there, and then I'll put the avocado tree here. I think. No, I will not do that. Um, what I'm gonna have to do. Is I'd put it on the right hand side island. But we do have an island on the left. I'm gonna I'll come back for the bananas. I'll wait for those to crack on with that. Now then, can you get me paid? No? Oh, I'm on 581. So we can come here. There we go. Now we can get an avocado tree. Oh no, we can actually get a coconut tree. Ah, but that's actually Just checking the size of them. I think the coconut tree will be able to fit in elsewhere. There we go, that's it. Nice. So we can, you know, we've got all those to plant. We've also got, well, that's in the water, that's on land, and I don't know what that one is. But either way, that's pretty much the moment to moment of the game. It is a fairly chill, cutesy game about fishing and gathering, talking to weird creatures, and yeah, that's pretty much what it is. Um, it's not going to be for everybody. Like I said, I picked it up because I played Merchant of the Skies, uh, one of the developers of the games, and I quite enjoyed that. And I'm very much enjoying this. It's just something to chill out to. I can't speak for its longevity. Hopefully, it's not too short. The fact that it says, you know, in the Steam listing, it is a short game is like, yeah, I mean, I just like being in here and just chilling out to it. It's not complex at all. It's not, it's say, stressful. I mean, now and again, when you're doing the fishing stuff, it can be uh, quite... Ta taxing like that but if you really want you can put it onto the simpler mode in fact I will show you that after I've caught this fish um, I'll show you the simple mode just in case you want to do that so there's that caught so over to escape options uh, gameplay and input and then simple fishing which I think is a bit too simple for my liking so press and hold and you reel it in and then once it starts to fight like that you let go and let it go down then you come back up so there's no real challenge to it if you keep winding then you'll break the line um so yeah just let it go down and this is like the simple mode like i say i prefer the prefer the other one i don't know if it's i think it's based on time rather than how much you reel in there you go and probably one more yeah then we'll come in that should be us no there we are that should be it just out the water and there we go black bass just change that over because I prefer that one. Simple fishing off. Mouse controls only. Yeah. Looks like you can use gamepad as well, but I have not tried that. Either way, that's been a bit of the game. Like I said, it's not going to be for everybody. I can understand people's hesitance to uh, check it out because, you know, it's, it's hard to pigeonhole the game what it is. But that's why I want to do a video of it because I am enjoying it. I'm chilling out to it. It is what it is. Just a little simple, honest game that uh, is quite weird <laughs> but like I say uh, something I am enjoying and uh, do find it quite relaxing oh good grief we've got loads of pine pineapple tree oh no you can't build there right there's loads of places we can build now with our money over oh look at that yeah those uh those guys have sorted me right out 
Uh, I think we can build a coconut tree in here, can't we? Nah, we can't. Okay. Either way, we're going to leave it there for now, because otherwise I will be on here for <laughs> a considerable amount of time. That's been a bit of the game. If you want to see more battles, me, let me know. And, uh, you know, like to hear your comments, suggestions, feedback, etc. What you like about the game, what you dislike. You know, just your thoughts and feelings on it, and whether it's for you or not. But if you want to see more, let me know. Otherwise, uh, yeah, link's in the description. So you can check it out yourself if you do so desire. Either way, hope you have enjoyed this video, and hopefully it's been a chill one for you. Thanks very much for watching. Take care, and I've hardly had a sip of beverage. <coughs> I went down the wrong, I went down the wrong way. <coughs> Do you know, panic. <coughs> Death.